Families in our community face unique challenges every single day. From my own life experience, I know that when people come together and work hard, positive change happens. Our family didn't have much money. My twin brother Doug and I shared three paper routes. We collected bottles door to door, mowed lawns, shoveled snow. And when the time came, we were fortunate enough to get scholarships to help us access a post-secondary education. Scholarships meant everything to us. We wanted to make sure every single Canadian had the same opportunity. So we started a nonprofit called Twinbro. For more than 10 years, we traveled across British Columbia, helping tens of thousands of kids get scholarships to access post-secondary education and become Canada's future leaders. The two threads of my career before I ran as a member of parliament were education and entrepreneurship. In my company, I learned how to create value for others and how to create jobs and contribute to the economy. I also began to teach entrepreneurship and finance at Simon Fraser University and at the University of British Columbia. I firmly believe that with the right tools, anyone can learn to invest in themselves and with hard work, get ahead. The desire to help people and to dedicate everything you have towards that is the same mentality I brought to the table in my first election campaign. In 1999, 22 years ago, at 17 years old, I ran for a seat on city council. I ran on a platform of hard work and accountability, I met everyone I could going door to door to make sure that the community's priorities were my priorities. I ran against 26 other candidates, but on election day, I became British Columbia's youngest ever elected official. Since 2013, when I first started working to be your member of parliament in Burnaby North Seymour, I've taken the exact same approach. I focus my energy on building strong relationships within our community. I work with families, individuals, businesses, nonprofits, and other elected officials from all parties and from all levels of government. Working together, we are able to deliver so much for our community. Strong representation is about building trust and delivering for the needs of our neighbors. This is why I continue to knock on doors, make phone calls, and read through your feedback surveys. I always read what you send me and I'm actively publishing what I'm working on so that everyone can see the work that I'm doing on your behalf. Being your representative is about caring for people, investing in people, and doing collectively what we can't do independently. Reconciliation, affordability, climate change, and our recovery from the COVID-19 pandemic are real challenges that are facing our community with serious and immediate consequences. We must address these challenges with the resilience, innovation, and hard work that Canadians are known for. In our first term of office, we showed that we could invest in Canadians while lowering our debt to GDP ratio. We grew our economy, created more than a million jobs, maintained our AAA credit rating, and reduced poverty to all time historic lows. We also made unprecedented investments in protecting our environment and improving the affordability of fundamental needs such as housing, education, and healthcare. We still have challenges, and there's still a lot of work to be done to make sure that every Canadian has a fair and equitable path to success. Canada enjoys the highest standard of living on our planet, but many in our community are not sharing in that success. A strong and empowered middle class ensures that families have the resources to invest in themselves and in their children. This is how we've improved our collective quality of life over previous generations, and we need to ensure that we continue to do this. These challenges are very real, but we need to approach them with optimism. As we've seen throughout the COVID-19 pandemic, governments, businesses, nonprofit organizations, frontline workers, emergency responders, and individual Canadians have pulled together to take on the largest challenge we face since the Second World War. By working together, we are now the most vaccinated country in the world. But the battle against COVID is not over. We need to address the inequalities in our society that were exposed by this health emergency. We can and should emerge from this pandemic stronger than ever. And our government has put together a detailed plan to do just that. My focus on building a better future has been strengthened by my growing family. Ravi and I welcomed Nova to the world in 2018. And during the pandemic, her sister, Solar, was born. Like me, Ravi grew up in a family 
that had very little, but believed in a Canada that created opportunities for everyone to succeed. Ravi and I met at Simon Fraser University, where she graduated and then started her own manufacturing company. We are working together to build a better future for our kids and for your kids and for every single Canadian. I've been elected twice now to represent Burnaby and North Vancouver here on the unceded and traditional territories of the Musqueam, Squamish and Tsleil-Waututh peoples. During that time, I haven't taken a single day for granted. Being your representative is the honor of my lifetime. It's a rare job where I get to help people and learn something new every single day. Now in the previous two elections, I said that most individuals don't actually need to deal directly with their member of parliament, but when they do, it's usually important and they need someone that they can trust and who they know will work hard for them. Looking to the future, I'm ready to continue delivering on your priorities. Whether it's fiscal responsibility and building a strong economy with quality, high-paying jobs, or delivering a more affordable future with more affordable housing, childcare, and education, I am ready for our next challenge. Whether it's old age security, reconciliation, climate change, or protecting our oceans, our government has taken unprecedented action and we are ready and prepared to do more. It is a lot to take on, I can't do it alone. I need your support, I need your ideas, most importantly I need your trust. I promise to give everything I have to build a better future for you and your family. With your support, we can build a better Canada for everyone.